how to use Seesaw for assessments. So first, I would pull up the Seesaw account. This is Cohort C Assessments. Then I might go to Activities. That's where I will uh, put the assessments. So this is the beginning of the year assessment. And uh, once you have the student in front of you on Zoom, you would press Add Response. Select the student, say this is the sample. Sorry, my Wi-Fi is a little slow. Then it should come up. Let me check my Wi-Fi again. Okay, it looks like it's coming. Okay, so once it comes up, you would administer the assessment just like you would in person. So you would ask the child um, to tell you the name of the letter and the sound. If they know the name of the letter, I would put a circle. And if I, they know the um, sound, I would give them a check. So if they were able to say teach, I would circle and put a check. So I would go through all the uppercase letters, lowercase letters, colors, shapes, and numbers. So as for the colors, shapes, and numbers, I would circle it if they know it. And if they don't know it, just leave a blank. And just ask them to start at um, one and see how high they can count and write the number. After the child is finished, you would just press the check. And this would submit their score. And that would be it. Just to share this on Zoom, all you would need to do is to make sure that your um, this is pulls up. You would go to Zoom. Um, say I have a new meeting start. Okay. I'm gonna turn off my video. Join with the audio. Share screen. and I would just click on the screen to share. And I would go through those exact same steps with the screen shared so that the child could see the assessment.